Hello, you cool cats. This is Mina with another episode of Ye Saint. Um, we still need to find where that treasure map leads, and also we need to find out um, where to get that fish recipe for uh, Car Crash. Although I'm not looking forward to helping Car Crash, but for the sake of completion, right? <clears throat> so. I don't know where we're gonna get those things, but we'll figure it out. Um, there's that, oh yeah, that's, there's that, um, this right here was that dark place, right? We don't have enough people for that. And we can also like open up some of these areas with the insect repellents. I feel like we should do that. Um, let's, let's first go to the waterfall grotto, um, where we couldn't really go through here before because it was so dark. Well, we could, but we weren't, like, oh, finding anything. There. Right there. Yeah. Oh, something's there. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, in the dark right right now. Now. Right right off. Off. It's down. Nice. So we'll clear out all of those things. <laughs> I left something back there. <laughs> I bet I can catch a lot. Okay. Here we go. Let's try and catch some fish What's in here. Today? Awesome. I'm not expecting anything new down here. There. All right. I should honestly have that doctor make more potions for me. Yeah. Oh, this Over here. <laughs> Gotta grab that iron ore. Ooh, a treasure, <laughs> chest. <laughs> treasure chest is exciting. Blue cape. Okay. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. All right. Now yeah. we get to do the yeah. upper part. Which I'm sure is going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. I imagine these things are big on their status effects. Lucky us. Oh, there's something there. Oh, something's there. Nice. Found a new location. What a superb view. Hopefully there's a lot of iron ore. <laughs> that would make this exciting for me. This is rare. Nope, just a ton of stalactite. Well, there's iron ore, but a lot of stalactite. Okay. And we're gonna make my way across over there. <clears throat> Without falling, please. <clears throat> Not really. Okay. We fell. Intentionally. Oh, that didn't lead to anything. Well, that's unfortunate. I thought that was something. Different. Okay. Well, I'm going. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> We've uncovered this area, I believe. Yeah, it's a hundred percented. Pirate booty is down that way. Ooh. You know what? We can take that insect repellent and go that other way. Yeah. 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 
This is going to be, uh, going back to places we've already been, but... Oh, there seems to be something in the tree. Cleaning up. Oh, wait. Always go and break these. I am in need of a lot of iron ore. Not a little. A lot. Like, all material is good. But... Especially the ore. Alright, so... Let's go this way first. <clears throat> okay. That's close enough. We'll go there. Insect repellent. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> oh, there's something there. Leave it to me. Switch. I guess let's hug left first. See where left takes us. <clears throat> Fog is getting thicker. Be careful. It's much more dangerous now that our vision is impaired. <gasps> oh, ah, what the? It's too dangerous to fight. Let's get out of here. I'm guessing I'm I can't attack all. those creatures. <gasps> Which is fine. I'm just exploring. Okay. I don't know how to go up those hills. So, we can't go that way. That's a dead end. We'll just have to remember... This way led to a dead end. Keep hugging the left. <laughs> How many? I need one more person. Oh, I need one more person. As soon as I find one more person, we come back here in case Hummel decides to leave us. Okay, that leads to another area, but how much of this map have I uncovered? All right, let's take it. Let's take this path. See where it takes us. We seem to have arrived at the shore opposite Castaway Village. This beach stretches out really far. What say we call it Longhorn Coast? I didn't mean to interrupt him. Note 5. Keep your ears open for hissing sounds like you'd hear a lizard or a snake make. That means they're close, and they can appear from anywhere and everywhere. Those among us who have gone mad are sure to be eaten by those things. I thought we were dreaded pirates. When did we become cornered prey? Needle wristband. 
I don't know how to get up there. I'm trying to just roll away. Okay, the beach is a dead end. What's on this beach? Treasure chest. Ooh, how do I get up there? Treasure chest. Treasure chest. Oh, something's there. Up there is probably where that pirate booty is, because I I remember seeing it over here on the map. And I see a little marker on the Oh jeez. Very sweet. <clears throat> Beehive. <laughs> what a sight. Use the numbers written on the treasure as clues and search the area. Oh. Oh, God. Is it really going to make me guess? Right there? Okay, sweet. Alright, we got the pirate treasure quest done. We still need to find Car Crash's recipe. Ooh. That might lead to trouble. So what else do we got on the beach? That brute yeah. Is what is Oh is that there's a kid Oh huh look A child we should talk to him gonna do it's okay we're here now ah uh, people we were passengers aboard the Lombardia did you wash ashore here too I'm Raja yeah I washed ashore here but I don't know what happened when I woke up he was gone was there someone else with you my rescuer I was only able to get here because he let me cling to him. We've been together since we got here. Where did he go? Oh no, we must search this area at once. Right. He was the only person I saw. I'm guessing... Yeah. Maybe someone will appear on yeah. the... Not here. It wouldn't... It's not gonna let me cross this beach, will it? It will! Is he gonna be on the same map? Like, how far of an area do I have to search? It's probably not back here. It's probably on the map that I haven't been to yet, right?
Because I assume that kid's not going to come with me until I find the other person. Maybe this way? Oh, okay. Oh, look at that. It wouldn't let me go this way. Okay. You know what that means. It's definitely on the previous map. It let me go to that other map. I don't see anything here. Maybe down there? Something's there. Wait, was there something up there? Yeah. I didn't see it. Yeah. Uh Hopefully it's not a corpse. Nothing here. What is that? Huh? Say, isn't that a... It's a pickard, a type of livestock. This one doesn't seem to be feral, though. Perhaps it washed ashore when the ship sank. You think it was on the Lamardia? That seems to be the case. Look you, look you! Pickard is intently eating something. Whoa, there's wild eggplants growing here. Look you! There's something in its mouth. Looks like a large eggplant seed. It could be valuable. Perhaps we should take it with us. It's strange, isn't it? We're supposed to be looking for a castaway, but we found a Pickard instead. Could this be a coincidence? It might not be a coincidence. This might be the thing that brought him to the island. Oh, what do you mean, Adol? Are you saying this critter could have really rescued that kid? Yeah, you gotta be kidding me. It's walking toward that boy. Huh, you think so? Hmm, it would be faster to just ask him directly. Oh, it's a big thing. <laughs> oh my gosh! I was so worried that the beast might have gobbled you up. So my hunch was right. Uh, well, <laughs> it's not like I care about a farm animal or anything. This guy rescued me, so I figured I should keep him around, that's all. That's not what it looks like, but I'll say no more on the subject. I'm Rhea. Oh, it's Rhea. I'm the heir to House Dior, the wealthiest family in all of Greece. Okay, so... I'm actually a genius. <laughs> but with everything that happened, I guess I got a little overwhelmed. Anyway, I'm pleased to meet you all. <sighs> what a little blowhard. Still, I'm surprised a child managed to survive this all... this long all by himself. He might not be lying about being a genius. Yeah, let's take him back to the village. I'm imagining we're actually going to escort him. Okay. Oh, you got a new face with you. <coughs> I did that voice wrong. I did it more like Sahai. Whatever. Yes, he's just a boy, so we thought it'd be safer if we brought him back ourselves. I'm Rhea, eldest son of House Dior. <laughs> hmm? That name sounds familiar to me, but who cares? What's that, your emergency food supply? Mug you, mug you. N no. This is my, uh, my. Um, it's my pet, sorta. <laughs> I'm just messing around. But if you're good with farm animals, then I've got a perfect job for you. I want to clean this place up and turn it into a farm. Everyone's got to pull their weight around here, so that includes you too, kid. What are you talking about, big guy? 
I'm a rich child genius. I'm not cut out for this kind of work. Don't say that. We all gotta do our part here. Except for Sir Car Crash. He's a... He's a human waste. <clears throat> Just water the plants and pull the weeds while you take care of your pet. Nothing to it. <sighs> Only one problem, though. I don't have any seeds we can plant to grow crops. With fresh vegetables, we can make all kinds of delicious meals. I have some seeds. Hey, what gives? Oh, really? How fortunate. If you find any seeds, could you pass them along to the kid? I'll let you handle planting them. What? Why is this happening to me? After consoling the pouty, pouty Rhea, Adol helped prepare the farm. Rhea's attitude slowly improved, and he began to perform his duties on the farm a bit redu reluctantly. Okay, I planted the seeds. But I have no idea how to grow them. Need to water them every day. Okay, I'll give it a try. Can you stop by and check on them too, Adol? Um, I'd appreciate it if you could help me with the harvest. We'll do it together! Let's make sure this kid doesn't grow up to be like a car crash. Alright, so we can visit him regularly. Ah, <laughs> uh, poor kid. But he should count as a person. So that means we can do that area. Which is... Wait. No. Down here. Yes, 12. But there was also something else over here. I didn't I didn't understand what was over here because we kind of weren't allowed to walk over here. So let's go over here. Finish that. Let's just hug the right over here first. It's never off the table. Athlete belt. I don't remember where that that thing was, but I'm also trying to uncover the map while I'm doing this. Was it this way? Which way? Okay, it was that way. Up here. Okay. Let's get rid of this. Okay, I'm gonna start yeah. on this. Thanks, everyone. All right. So, what is over here? A campsite. Huh. Check this out. A makeshift shelter it appears to have been recently constructed, too. No one's here. Why am I glad to see other survivors on this island? Who is it? Eep! Sorry, sorry. I forgot I was holding this. I just stepped away to harvest some edible plants. Don't worry. I'm not gonna hurt you.
Meralda? My name is Meralda. I help out in my husband's restaurant in Greek. I had just bought some ingredients and was on my way home when the ship sank. You guys must have been on the Lombardia too, huh? Adol introduced the others and explained the situation to Meralda. Okay, so we're on a deserted island, and it's the Isle of Saren of all places. Still, I'm relieved to know that there are other survivors besides me. <laughs> I recognize that red hair. You must be Adol. You're that brave young man who fought off the monster that attacked the ship. You look so dashing out there. Ahem, moving on. You seem to have adjusted to your new circumstances rather well. Yes. Sure have. Lucky for me, I still have my favorite kitchen knife. A stubborn cook is a force to be reckoned with. A st and a stubborn wife even more so. Why did I drop my controller? <laughs> yeah, ain't that the truth. Men are helpless against a stubborn wife. I wouldn't know. I was worried about my husband, but I'm really worried about my kids. I hope they're okay. All six of them. Six! Yes, I hope your children are. What? You mean to say you have given birth to six children? But your figure is stunning. You look too young to be married. <laughs> Butter me up all you like, but you won't get any special treatment from me. Now then, I'd like to join Castaway Village right away. I'll take care of all the household chores, cooking, cleaning, laundry, you name it. I don't know how to do a voice for her. I'm... There's a lot of voices. And I realized that her voice was slipping into Laxia a little bit, but... Say la vie. Okay, so there's nothing else here. Have I... I now have, like, 13 people. How many did I need over here? I need one more person. Oh, I'm so close. 20. God, there's like 20 people out there? That's... Okay, so... There's nothing else over there, right? We've mostly been through... What? What is that? It's... I don't... It's gonna be something in there, but... That's the underwater part that I can't get to. So we just need one more person. Alright, well... I guess... We gotta go the opposite direction. We need to go... The other way with the insect repellent that I didn't use. And taking a look at the timestamp, I think we'll have to... Actually, we should end the <coughs> recording here. But let me hop back over here. Triple check that we didn't get anything new. Nope, still didn't need a delicious meal. Wait, she can cook. So maybe she can cook the, the food that I need? You guys seem really busy every single day, Adol. Are you all eating properly? We only eat fruit. That's what I thought. Looking at your face, you seem restless. You're limited on ingredients, too, so you're not getting enough nutrients. I know. You bought me a lot of vegetables, so I'll make you some vegetable juice. It's high in nutrients, it'll fill your stomach, too. Yes, that's a great idea. I'll make it with lots of love, so you can come get it any time. You can now make vegetable juice. Ah, uh, that is not really what I wanted. Unfortunate. This is a nice kitchen. It must have been a lot of work to gather all this equipment. <laughs> now I'm excited to show off my cooking skills. Look forward to it. No chest down there.
No, I don't want to rest there. Okay, nothing new between them. I have a feeling she's pregnant based on the way he reacted. Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for... <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this Let's Play episode of Yeast I'm having a lot of fun with this game, so much so that I really want to beat this game next. Um, out of all the games that I'm playing right now. So, I'm definitely going to be trying to push to get this one done as quickly as possible. And then we can work up on uh, completing all the other ones as well. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!